video, we are going to use use Kirchhoff's voltage law to verify that the calculated current in each resistor is indeed correct. What we're going to do, we're going to use Kirchhoff's voltage law, which states that the algebraic sum of the voltages around a closed loop is zero. To check to see if our calculated currents would indeed yield a, a, a algebraic sum of zero for this loop and for this loop. Okay, so let's start. Let's start with this loop. So we start from here to here and we see that that's a voltage rise. So we have plus 10 plus algebraic sum from here to here is a voltage fall from plus to negative. So that's a voltage fall. So that's a negative 2.85 times 4. So 2.85 times 4 is the voltage and it is negative. From here to here is a voltage rise. So algebraic sum is a voltage, is algebraic sum and it's a voltage rise. So it is 0 0.46 six times three ohms equals. So we add these together now and we get 10 minus 2.85 by four. 2.85 by four gives 11.4. So negative 11.4. Plus 0.46 by 3, 0.46 by 3 equals to 1.38, 1.38 equals. We add them now, so we get 10 minus 11.4 plus 1.38 equals negative 0. Point o two, which is close enough to zero. Okay, so we have demonstrated that the algebraic sum of the voltages around this closed loop is zero. We repeat for the other side. We start from here to here. That's a voltage fall. So we get negative eight. Plus, what do we have here? From here to here, the voltage rise. So that's 3.31 times 2. That's the voltage rise. From here to here is also voltage rise. Algebraic sum plus. So voltage rise of 0 0.46 times 3 ohms equal, and we're going to check to see if that is indeed 0. So we have negative 8 plus 3.31 times 2 is 6.62, 6.62 plus 0 0.46, 0 0.46 times 3 plus 1.38, 1.38. All right, equal. Let's see if this adds to zero. So we add the 6.62 and the 1.38 and then subtract 8. 
plus 1.38 minus 8 equals 0. Exactly 0. So we have demonstrated that the algebraic sum of the voltages around this closed loop is 0. And this, and this verifies that the currents we calculated are indeed correct.